Hello everyone, my name is Jeremy Walsh and I am the Director of Support for BNI Connect. Today's brief lesson will be on creating a discussion group in BNI Connect. One of the great things about BNI Connect is that it brings the entire BNI community together in one place. Besides the ability to view another member's profile and connect with them, BNI Connect offers another great online networking opportunity through the discussion groups. The groups in BNI Connect are a way for BNI members and directors around the world to get together and have discussions, share ideas, and even pass referral opportunities. Although there are currently hundreds of groups active in BNI Connect, you may wish to create your own dialogue. Here's how to create a group in BNI Connect. First, click on the My Network link to access the social media functions in BNI Connect. In the Groups tile, Click on the Manage button. Here, you will be able to see the complete list of public groups available in BNI Connect. To create your own group, click on the Add Group button. All users can create up to seven of their own groups that they directly manage in BNI Connect, although you can participate in as many groups as you'd like to. The first thing you want to do is to create a name for your group. I'm going to call this one BNI Connect Support. Next, you'll want to choose what type of group. You can choose from an open group, which means that anybody will be able to search for and participate in this group. You can choose an invite only group, which means that it will be hidden from the searches and only the owner and moderators can invite people to join the group. Or you can choose a members can invite group. That type of group will still be hidden, but any member, including the moderators and the owners, will be able to invite to that group. Choose a good description for the group to let people know what you will be talking about. The language will allow you to let people know what the primary language of the group is. Keep in mind that none of the posts will be automatically translated. This is just to let people know what language the discussion will take place in. You can also invite any of your connections to join the group as soon as it's created. Note that this is a multi-select field, so if you hold the control button down, you can select multiple people. Once you're ready, click Submit. Now that your group is created, it will appear in your My Groups. Click on the group name to start the discussion. Click the Add New Topic button to get the conversation started. Once you've put in a topic name and description, click Submit. Now people will be able to read your post and comment on it. As a group owner or moderator, it is also a good idea to be sure that you are receiving notifications so that you can actively participate in the conversation. To do this, click on Options and then My Account. Then click on the Account Settings tab, the one that looks like a gear. In your group post email notifications, make sure that you've selected Once Per Day or Every Time a New Post is Added to make sure that you can get notified whenever somebody makes a comment in your post and that you stay active in the conversation. Be sure to click Update to save your settings. Now that you know a little bit more about creating a group in BNI Connect, get connected and participate in the global discussion. We hope this helps. Happy connecting!